Hey, 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 Big Dave the Middle-Aged Gamer here with another episode of Sim Settlement 2 for Fallout 4, and we got it back up and running. It's alive! And we are at the Murkwater construction site, if you remember how it ended the last episode. We have got our max relationship with Mara, and it is time to get Nick. But first things first, we have some other things we need to take care of real quick. We're going to start by defending Jamaica Plain. And apparently we beat whatever is here. Fascinating. We are at Jamaica Plain. At the very eastern, southwestern edge of it. Oh no, wait, here we go. assault rifle. If he's still alive, then that means <clears throat> well, the fuck's got an armor piece. <laughs> Never thought I'd be happy to see raiders. Black knighted him. Hey, where did his shit go? Oh boy. And how the hell did I end up over here? I don't care about the raiders. They're not the threat. Okay, our our sentry bot is distracted. Let's find the rest of the goons. Gunners, goons, whatever. There we go. Okay. There we go, finally a clear shot. Now that gets... Looks like we're not quite done here yet. Even though we have successfully defended against the gunners. That's just Hyde Park. 
They're just being stinkers right now. Okay. So we're going to save after all that successful shenanigans. Okay, while we're here, let's take a look at the place, huh? Alright. Looks like everything uh, on the left is satisfied. And we have a... Oh, boy. Okay, how am I supposed to get up there if everybody's still freaking out? Ugh. Okay, I guess we're not done yet. Wait, that's ours and it's hostile to me? Uh-oh. What did I do? <laughs> As I said, this is Hyde Park. Okay, are they retreating? Okay, another legendary assess uh asset operators. Okay, all right. I know what I'm trying to say. It ain't coming out. An assassin's operator's chest piece. That's fine. And my settlers are invading the neighbors. <laughs> You can't make this stuff up. <laughs> fine, fine. Yeah, I don't know why that's not working anymore. Okay, well, it says everybody's got a job, so just need to build another place to live. Go. 
go. Okay, well, here's where... We're going to turn that around, and then we're going to add another resonance. Let's get this queued up at the very least. No. Alright, we finally got the all clear. Everything's going to settle down. Okay. No, we're actually not going to pick that, because that's an indoor thing, not an outdoor thing. Okay, so... Sure. Let's go with that. Nice and simple. Now what we're going to do is we're going to tag this and track the settler. And we're going to take a look at him. Actually... Is an easier way down. Ugh. And of course, the new guy was, uh, the new settler was on the invading force. Okay, so our spotter has perception training. Okay, well, we need to change them to agility, because that's not what you want. All right, so we're going to have to cheat here. Okay, we're going to see if that works, and we're going to take them. Over here. It, okay, it did work. Good, good, good. And we're going to go back to within the confines of the settlement. This will do. Now we just need to find the agility plot, and it's right here. And just to see if it transferred up. Okay, it hasn't yet.
And just to make sure I'm actually looking at the right thing here, I'm going to switch tracking. And yes, I do have it right. Good, good. We'll turn off tracking. Okay, that is done. That will help. So that's done everything we need to uh, that we can do for now. Otherwise, this place is in really good shape. But we don't have anything for the next settler to do whenever they come in, and that's fine. We'll just look on based on what they've grabbed and what their stats are. We'll figure it out from there. Actually, that's not entirely true, because... Uh, we do have something available. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah, but if and when they get here, are we going to remember that? Likely not. Actually, no, there is one thing I want them to do. Because they're coming in all, uh, cold, they're not going to be able to do that. So we're going to track the person who does this, and they're not very far away, just on the other side of the building. We're going to move them to the other one, because... They can. Because you need at least a five intelligence to do that. And they've been doing that long enough, I know for a fact they have over a five intelligence. There we go. It's taken. Which means this no longer is, which means the next other that comes in can just grab it. We'll just have to make sure they take intelligence. As to as a uh, as leisure. Okay, we're gonna save now. Now we're done here. This place is caught up, and we're gonna go to the other place that needs our help. Actually, we need to talk to a settler just to. Hey. Thanks for your help fighting the mob. I didn't want you to have all the fun. That's what you call fun. I'm glad you're on our side. Anyway, we appreciate the help. And... We're going to turn the subtitles back on. Okay, now we have to go. Is that a custom marker? Oh, right! That's where the TARDIS is. I knew that. Okay, we got one more place we need to defend, and that's County Crossing. Let's go. Alright, County Crossing! And the fun's already begun. I hear it, but I don't see it, and I hate that. More gunners. And I'm overloaded. And we have a dead caravan guard. That sucks. I love when they don't need my help. Then again, the gunners I'm seeing, uh, yeah. Just wanted to trade a few things. Sure. Okay, wasn't expecting that. Just looking to trade a little. Okay. <sighs> I want to trade a few things. I can't say every day. Oh 
Okay, so first things first, we have a few things we need to dismantle. Yeah, you don't get anything from scrapping vault suits. That was supposed to be something, but it obviously wasn't, unfortunately. <clears throat> okay, we got a whole bunch of junk out of all this. Hmm. So we need to improve defense and... Do we really have somebody that doesn't have a place to party? Really? Alright, well, first things first, we're going to upgrade. Actually, first things first, since we did all the defending things, let's save. Let's upgrade the defenses. They should have a lot of enough time where they can do this. Actually, no, we need more power first. Before we even do that, let's track our power person here and see if they can actually, we could actually just skip that. Here they are. And, oh yeah. Oh yeah. They can go nuclear here. Absolutely. Okay, first things first, we're going to turn off the tracking. Now we're going to upgrade. We're going to wait for this to build real quick. Alright, while well, that's building, we have somebody who doesn't have anything fun to do. Okay, it's not working. So, what we're going to do... First thing we need to do is we need to find a We're just going to build that real quick. 
simply because we need to Yeah, just build a few things here. We're going to put that in the workbench because we don't need it right now. And we're still needing more power. Hmm. That's fine, I guess. But we do have things we need to do here. Okay. There we go. I've been using this more than the meeting gavel anyway. Okay. We have this guy here. Hazmat Recycler. Okay. Let's see if I remember how to do that. Okay, here's the Settler. We're going to move them here. Now we're going to close this. There he is. And just to make sure, I'm going to scan them. Yep, that's the one. So anything outside of strength and intelligence is good for them. And there's an agility right here. A perfectly good agility, and we'll put them on that. Okay, and that's got that taken care of at least. Defense is still needing, but so is power, and upgrading the defense is uh, going to put more of a strain on the power, so we're going to wait on that. Eh, fuck it. Who am I kidding? Let's save. I think there's only one high-tech defense available for 2x2 two two plots. And it's the same one we get every single time. It's the, uh, it's the laser cannon. Yep. Alright, put that up. And we'll do the same for this one. Ah, there we go. We want high tech.
So we're just waiting for these defense plots to finish up, and then we'll be done here. But Dave, are you gonna put more people in here? We're pretty much out of space here. There's really no need to. I mean, yeah, we could stick a couple of things here, but at this point, what do we need? Okay, uh, well, we've got a shop. Yeah, tr truth be told, we could probably use more shops. It's also a case of living arrangements. We just don't have any left. Don't have much in the way of space left for that. Although, if I had to get really creative, I could probably find a way. Okay. That's up and running. There we go. Looks like upgrading the security was a was a win there. There we go. Let's see if we can upgrade this. Says there is an upgrade available. Up oh, and defenses, wigging out again. So yeah, never mind on that. <laughs> Well, I guess until those defenses upgrade and the power upgrades, we're kind of stuck here in this holding pattern. Huh? And that's another reason not to upgrade right now, because we're kind of sitting on a few upgrade, uh, important upgrades that need to be done. Okay. So now that we got a bunch of junk we need to deliver, and by deliver, I mean we're going back to Mercer. Safe house. And as you can see here, Ten Pines Bluff is now under attack. So once we're done here, we're going to have to go to Ten Pines Bluff and bail their asses out. Alright. We dropped off the junk, but there is something we need to do here. There's a few things we need to do here. But first and foremost, I'm still waiting on somebody else to show up here. We're going to save. Because if this doesn't work, we're going to be scrawled. We have Deacon running the farm here. So we know he's got the endurance for it. He has an 8 Endurance, so it's not like we can go high-tech here, but we could try and go advanced. And here's to hoping we have the materials for it. Home Improvement at the Castle. Interesting. Sure, let's take a stab at it. If we can get some uh, food improvements here, that'll actually go a long way towards improving this settlement. Right, buddy? Ha! It paid off. Alright, so we're going to get this, let this do its thing, and more home improvement at the castle. Always good to see. Oh, we got somebody new at Jamaica Plain. So we have to go over there, make sure they grab the proper leisure. Now that we got the settler UI thing back up and running, that should not be very difficult to do. And Jamaica Plains all on the way to Ten Pines Bluff. Considering Ten Pines Bluff is at the opposite end of the map, that's not very difficult to do. 
All right, so we're just waiting on the ag plot to do its thing. Dirty windows. Yeah, somebody needs to come up with a mod for uh, window cleaner. <laughs> I'm no modder, so don't look at me. Oh, that's pretty. Okay. We got the new one up, and... Oh! Damn! <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> it did improve, but just uh, quite enough. Oh, that hurts. Well, we'll save, because it it's still a win. Ugh. Okay, so... We need to go back to Jamaica Plain... We got somebody new there. Let's do it. And once again, magic add makeup lane. And let's find our new settler. Oh, that's a nice boost and happy. Okay, we're gonna bring this settler over. Let's take a look at them. Okay, strength training. All right, so we need to find them intelligence training. Because if you're doing power, that's what you're going to need. Oh. All right, we just need to wait for things to upload to load up. Oh, good, we have enough space. So, move them there, and that should take care of that. Why are we having food issues? Hey, magpie! Oh, what a little cutie! So we need to track everybody here. We need, actually, no, we don't need to track everybody. That's an easier way to do this. We have the Settler UI. Let's use it. Okay. Go three at the Brahmin farm, nine, eight, and seven. <clears throat> yeah, we can upgrade. Bye bye, Brahmin. Universal coffee, three by three. Coffee farm? Sure. Jamaica Plain sounds like a perfect name for a coffee company. Okay, so. Go back to a little more homey of an area. Bring up the settler UI again. Okay. Let's 
assign two job. There's only one job available, so it should do that. Oh, 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 oh. I see how this works now. Okay. It's the first time I've used this feature. All right, there should be one left. And assign to job. Assign to, to that. And no more unemployed, no homeless. And yeah. Yeah, that looks good. All right, so we just need to wait for this to uh, finish building, and hopefully that'll be enough food. So that's the one thing we're waiting on right now. You know what, while that's building, actually there is one other thing we need to do. to build a new residence. Pick one at random. See if it chooses anything good. Mm, no. All right, let's see if we could pick something better this time. Plywood Shack. So they'll get a new one queued up and remember what I said before about Worrying about a job for the new uh, for the next one when it comes in before realizing, oh wait, we had that uh, we had that one thing. Well, now that holds true. All Doc Weathers is here, but we don't need him right now. At least I don't think we do. Um, actually, yeah, I think we do. Done. You have some sort of medical problem here, or are you just yanking my chain? Could use some supplies, actually. I got loads of stim packs, chems, you name it. All right. Okay, that takes care of all that. And since we're here, we do have some stuff we need to get rid of. That'll do just fine. Okay, we're done here. 
Oh! Oh! Personal sensor as good looking as you. I should get one for myself. Oh, <laughs> well, thanks. That's very kind of you. Most people attack as soon as they find out what I am. It's good to know that there are still some good people left in this world that aren't consumed by hatred. But seriously, I am a sylph. I tell people when I meet them so they don't think I'm hiding something. Most people understand. However, some people try to kill me at that point. But I'm not like other synths. For one thing, I don't like violence. The Institute made me to replace the original Darsenia in Diamond City, but I... I have a glitch in my program because I don't want to. I don't see any reason to kill someone I've never even met, just so I can take her place. She never did anything to me. And even if she did, violence is not the answer. Sometimes I don't have a choice, but I won't kill needlessly. Just because the Institute made me does not mean I'm their slave. I will live my life my way. Which is what brings me here. I've heard about all you've been doing, and I was hoping you could help me out too. What do you need help with? I need you to find a courser and get a few parts off them. I'm hurt pretty bad, or I'd do it myself. Here's a list of what I'll need. And if you let me see that pit boy there, I'll mark a spot on your map. I know a place where coursers like to hang around sometimes. Once I have the spare parts, I'll use them to fix the damage I took fighting raiders. Until then, I'll stay here where it's safe. So we got a new settler quest. Awesome. Was not expecting this. This is awesome. Nonetheless. Okay. Well, we need to make our way north towards... Uh, Ten Pines Bluff. Oh no. Okay, well, first things first. Need to remark Jalbert Brothers. So I remember where, where the damn TARDIS is. But for now, we need to go back home to the new Cafe Ola because we have some stuff to get rid of. Inventory management to take care of before we make our way. To Ten Pines Bluff. And home sweet home. All the issues I'd been having with the game. It's good to actually see this place up and running again nicely. Alright, let's get rid of some crap here. We don't need that many frag mines. Uh... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, well that lightens the load considerably. Yes, yeah, for everything else, the vault suits can go in here. All that's left is the operator's chest piece. We need to find our operator's dummy, and it's dark in here. Hmm. Hey, look at that first guess. And there we go. That actually looks pretty good. So, well, the good news is that didn't take very long at all. And we're down to 108 pounds out of 402. That's actually rather nice. And... Yeah! How are we doing on ammo? Or three sets of ammo? see we've got the deliverer so that's 10 millimeter and about 1200 rounds that's fine and we've got 
Tinker Tom Special. It's uh, about 1,200 rounds as well. Again, that's fine. Okay. Now that we've done that, we need to go to Ten Pines Bluff. All right, Ten Pines Bluff, and we're dealing with raiders. No, we're dealing with, uh, and robots. Oh, bo oh boy. failing. Right in the brain case. We're not done here yet. Okay, now we're done here. <clears throat> Thanks for your help, pal. I didn't want you to have all the fun. If that's what you call fun, I'm glad you're on our side. Anyway, we appreciate the help. Okay. So that was easy. If you don't mind the storm. Okay. And it looks like we got some water problems too. Dude, you are not having a good day. <laughs> okay. So we're just going making sure every but everything's got what they need. In this case, ASAM sensors. Everything looks good there. And oh man, does it look nasty out. Okay. So we've got power issues here that we need to uh, reconcile quickly. Okay. Oh, that 
Bedouins. Oh. And Bedishes. That's also not good. Oh, Ten Pines is a friggin' mess. Wonderful. And we got some bored people on top of it all. Okay. So before we go any further, we need to look at our populace here. Okay, we don't have any unemployed. We're actually not having housing issues. It's just a couple of the spots is, uh, they're not counting as... Hmm, okay. Okay, what do you need? Perception and, char and charisma, huh? Julia Powell, okay. Hard to see when everything is completely uh, covered in dust. Okay, so charisma is busy. Okay. That's intelligence. That's a gem, so that's not perception. Agility. I know I have perception around here somewhere. Ah, here it is, and it's level one. Okay, that's why she doesn't have. Let's look at the rest. At the very least, let's get everybody happy and settled in. And then we'll have to end this video, because, yeah. Okay, Clover! Strength and Agility. You know what? This one we can do. I know... Agility is, is available. Finding it again on the other hand... That's just luck. Okay. Okay. Franklin is perception only. Oh, wow. Huh, good on you, bud. Knox is perception and charisma as well. Jeez, everybody in the same in the same problem, huh? Starting to see a pattern here, y'all. So we need for perception to upgrade, and we need for people to finish up with charisma too. What we also need to do is we need to build another power place. But since we've got incredibly limited space at this point, okay, actually, I think all the space available is on this end.
That works. Grab the caps. And... We've got some people with some really high intelligence. So we're just going to go high tech right off the bat. Okay, we're going to get that queued up and then we're going to bring this back up again, the Settler UI. And we're going to sort it by intelligence and see who's Universal Library. Okay, they're a farmer. Nope. That wasn't what I wanted to do. Try that again. Okay, sort by intelligence, defense, water, already doing uh, power, citadel. Okay, so we need to find Julia. Actually, for simplicity's sake, and for the I need to get this video wrapped up sake. Bring her to me. We're going to scan her, see what this says. Spotter. Okay, defense. Oh, okay. See what we keep finding here. Industrial, industrial, defense. Oh, I can't move him off of that. You know what? Yeah, Audra. That works. she go anyway there you are dear we get more power up and running that will help with this place and I don't know what's up with the bed situation sometimes the beds just don't register with some settlements too and I don't know Once this is up and running, and if this does get this does give me the power that I've been needing, then we'll be good to go. We can end the video. So we didn't quite get to moving along for Nick, but you know, we kind of got sidetracked with just about every settlement under our employ getting attacked. Oh, 
at least the winds of uh, the psycho winds have uh, settled down at least. Once this upgrades, we'll be able to start putting more people in, so that's always a good thing. Alright, that looks good. Oh! It's not power that we need, per se. Something's not connected. There we go. Probably for the best. And we've got plenty of power here and water issues. Well, the only thing complaining about an upgrade are the shops, and they're complaining about just not having enough people to upgrade. Thing is, it's awfully tight. Uh, it's an awfully tight fit in here already. I really don't know where to put any. You know what? Actually, yeah, I do. Do that. Does that get in the way of here? No, actually, it doesn't. Holy crap. <laughs> okay, so. Time to choose a building plan, and we're going to go for a multi here. Bedroom barracks? No. You know, all the multis are just uh, bunk beds and, and stuff.
Let's, we'll go with the tiny house. All right, that takes care of that. And the person that comes in can grab the can grab what Audra left, and then somebody else comes in. Yeah, we'll figure it out from there. <laughs> okay. But yeah, I think we're going to really have to end this video here. It's just uh, getting long. And uh, next video, yes, we will finally, because we are now finally ready, to go get Nick Valentine. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to get the latest and greatest videos as they come in. And to help this channel grow, this has been Big Dave the Middle-Aged Gamer. This is Sim Settlements. Who for Fallout 4. I'll see you all next time.